I'm Dr. Ryan Stanton and the doc is in. Seems like every time we turn around there's another virus trying to take the main stage and one that's getting a lot of attention right now is the monkeypox. Right now there's been around 2,500 cases confirmed across the United States. Most states have at least one case. But what we know about this is it's not nearly as contagious as what we see with the other viruses around. In fact, this takes very close if not intimate contact in the vast majority of cases. The challenge, however, is there's significant risk of morbidity and mortality associated with monkeypox. Common symptoms include fever, myalgias, headaches, and in many cases, the characteristic rash. This virus is very closely related to the smallpox and a very characteristic rash associated with that that will spread throughout the infection. It takes anywhere from one to three weeks for the infection to start to manifest and will typically last for two to four weeks afterwards. The biggest risk factors are going to be among those that are immunocompromised or don't seek treatment. The key here is once you develop or known exposure, get evaluated right away. One of the other challenges we're now going to face is shortages of the monkeypox vaccine, where people are rushing to get it and in areas where we don't have enough supply at this point. Hopefully that will alleviate within the next weeks to months. The most important thing here is if you're high risk, get vaccinated as soon as you can and decrease those risk factors and exposures as much as possible to decrease the spread of monkeypox. You can join the conversation on our Doc is in Facebook page and at Everyday Med on Twitter. I'm Dr. Ryan Stanton and the Doc is out.